Hello everybody, I'm back again, there you are, got a little bit of a different setup for this one, I thought after the last one where everything was so up close, I need to do something else, so I decided to do it like this. So I have another unboxing, what could it be? It's a mystery unless you read the description to this video. But anyways, after my last unboxing with the PlayStation 5, I know that like the uh, screen cap was just awful. And I know I, I'm, I'm normally just too lazy to change it because I know you can um, upload your own screen cap for it. But I just didn't do that. So. <laughs> so it's just like a picture of me doing like this. Or something. Like that. But I wasn't too crazy about that. But all the other ones sucked as well. So I had to just leave it with that. Because I at least I was doing something. So this one. I'm going to try to smile. And show everybody like. Hey, maybe the YouTube will pick up on that rather than the other one. It's me doing something awkward. So, anyhow, let's get down to it because I'm curious to see what exactly I have in here. Maybe I should have read the description to the video. But anyhow get down to it yes sir all right here's the box this is probably going to be hard to see but oh start cutting it yes mm -hmm. I was trying to cut it with the back of the blade. How embarrassing. Let's see. Let me see if I can't fix this where it will be on camera decently. What could that be? Is that Master Chief? Perhaps? I think it is. So anyways, let me make this a little bit more aw less awkward. That's right. It's an Xbox Series X. Bam. So maybe I should smile like this. So like people can like see that this is the unboxing. Let's see, let me get fix my camera here. Cause it's going all crazy on us. Alright, that's better. Hmm. 
these seals is that how it's sealed from the factory it's just like a square I was expecting this a few days ago so I'm really curious if like somebody didn't like take this home and was using it or something is my Xbox is my Xbox brand new What's the deal with this? I don't understand this tomfoolery. Anyhow. Some people peel these up. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to cut them. It's what I prefer to do anyway. There's one. There's two. Three. Last one's right here. I think that's it. Anyhow, let me switch it back here. Ooh. I don't think I'm going to use the, because it's just, this box is going to mess up my camera, so. Ooh. Ah. Let's see, I'll let you get a look at this, how they got it packaged here. Power your dreams. Very nice packing. Do like it. Like, probably be hard to lift the whole box up while it's like this, but. Mm. Got these nice foam inserts. Got ourselves. This is underneath the Xbox. Is this just an instruction booklet? Kind of looks like that. Foam inserts. Let's get to the controller. Let's see. bit of tape I won't go too crazy since we're close quarters here See, I, this D-pad here, that's like the first time they've done that, I believe. And it definitely does feel like it's more, like it's more grippier, for sure. Yeah. Full shot. But yeah, like definitely right through here, it feels a lot more grippier. 
new button there. Yeah, that D-pad's different. It's pretty neat. Dig it. It's got a set of batteries here. Looks like some Duracells. Very nice, very nice. Got us a HDMI wire, cable, I should say. Got a power cable. That's probably about it on that front, I would say. So now it's down to the big guy. A lot smaller than than the uh, PlayStation 5, that's for sure. Oh, there is instruction booklets. Let's see here. Mm. Here I go, I need to cut things again. Yeah, that just kind of ripped up anyhow. Ooh. It's a power button. I believe that's what it is. Sorry, microphone. Trying to show the camera. The Xbox Series X. Let's see if I can move this. Give you guys a closer up shots. Fix the camera because this is very awkward sitting. Get the knife out of the way so I don't hurt myself. Okay, let's transition. Here we go. Here's some ports we got here. Power, HDMI out, ah, the expansion port, some USBs, yeah, cool. Not much, I mean, it's just a box. Look at that, you can see my fingerprints on it already. Oh no. That didn't take long. And these holes. Oh my goodness. Would you look at that. I don't mean to trigger anybody who has any uh, phobias of holes. But there you go. I hear you can put like a, a, a ping pong ball and it will actually float. I don't know if that's true or not. That may be just some of the uh, craziness that you come across like the whole the vaping thing into your xbox and the smoke was blowing out the top come on now i knew when i saw that i was like there's nothing in the xbox series x that's going to create that much smoke you would have to have a huge capacitor inside of one that's like that big around like inside of the this xbox to make which there's there's no capacitor that big inside of this thing or 
a flyback transformer, which that's only used in like old CRT monitors. So you're not going to have anything like that. That is going to produce that much smoke coming out of the top of the Xbox. It was a funny thing to see smoke coming out, but yeah, basically what they were doing, they were blowing their vape smoke into the bottom of this and then it was coming out the top. Very amusing, but come on now. There it is. That is my Xbox Series X. I am happy to see it. That's a little bit of a surprise unboxing for everybody to show you that I have spent a lot of money this month. And I am not a Sony person. I'm not a Microsoft person. If I had to say any type of person I was, I'm probably more of a Nintendo person, but I do not pick one console and just go with it. Back in the days I did this, when you had the Super Nintendo, and I loved role-playing games for the Super Nintendo, and I, I, I was just so into Final Fantasy, and then I found out that Final Fantasy was going to be on the PlayStation with Final Fantasy VII, and it broke my Nintendo fanboy heart. And I was so perplexed because I was going with the Nintendo 64. I was not buying a PlayStation. And then Symphony of the Night, it was already out on the PlayStation. I was already torn with it, you know, thinking I need a PlayStation kind of. But, like, I just didn't want to do it because I was a Nintendo fanboy. I was loyal to them. And it just got to the point to where it's like, Resident Evil, Castlevania Symphony of Night, Twisted Metal, uh, what other games did I want to play for it back then? All kinds of games. I mean, I got a PlayStation kind of late, and I was just like, I gotta get one. <laughs> you know, I gotta play Symphony of Night. I'm such a huge Castlevania fan. There's no way that I couldn't, like get in on that so I got one and I was happy and I and and I thought why the hell am I being loyal to Nintendo when I can just have everything I'm a consumer why be loyal to one thing so since that day I have decided I'm just gonna buy whatever console I want why limit myself I can play every exclusive game so that is why I have an Xbox Series X. I have a PlayStation 5. I have a Nintendo Switch. I have a CDI, a Philips CDI. Yeah. That was given to me though by my by my buddies. Uh yeah, they just said, here, just take it. <laughs> they're, they're, they're not playing any games on this. I have a, a lot of systems. I think the only thing I don't have... I'll have to come up with a list. I don't have the Fairchild. I don't have that. I don't have um, a working in television. <laughs> I don't have um, a Jaguar CD. I have a Jaguar, but not the CD. Um, 3DO I don't have, Neo Geo I don't have. So yeah, that's about the only systems I can think of off the top of my head right now that I do not have. There's probably some other ones out there that I'm not thinking about, like Sinclair or whatever. That probably wasn't even in this country, I don't think. And that's, isn't that a computer anyways? I have a, I have an Aquarius. You guys seen the video on that. But anyhow, thank you for watching my unboxing video of the Xbox Series X. I hope it turned out alright because I just wanted to switch it up to another setting. So my, my setup here for the cameras because 
I felt very confined when I was opening the PlayStation 5. So, hopefully it works. But anyhow, thank you for watching. I'll catch you around. Take it easy.